Hey, it's Mike Lang here. I'm going to show you a quick demo on how to do a circle uh, mat for vMix call. So you start out by creating a black frame with a white circle. Do this in any, you know, you could do it in, my, in Windows Paint if you want, any graphics program. Um, the same size as your, your format. So I'm 1080p, so this is a 1920 by 1080 black, uh, a black graphic with a white circle, and I just saved it as a, a PNG, but any, any uh, graphic format will work. So you're going to go to your vMix call here, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in and create a virtual input because I don't want to modify the full screen version in case I need it. I'm going to go to my virtual vMix call. You just choose settings on the input, go to color key, and pick this graphic, which is input one. Pick your black and white graphic. Circle, and now you can go to multi-view. I'm sorry, you go to position, and you can move it around. And you can position it on the frame where you want. And I'm going to key it, I'm going to burn it into a multi-view on this input. So I'm going to go into here, the settings, multi-view, and I'm going to go pick my call, which is actually number six. I picked the full frame version by accident. There's my virtual call with the key fill applied, and I can position it anywhere on here. If I want to create multiple calls, you can use that same mat over and over again. And uh, I'm going to put another one over here. And there you go. Now you have your virtual vMix call in a circle, and then you have your full screen version here that you can still cut to. Hope that helps.